Hey guys, Ben Wild here. I was tagged by uh, Blocker Bob. He wanted to know if I've ever had a bad experience at a gun shop. Um, I gotta say that I have never had anything that I guess you could say was a bad experience. Um, I've had uh, pretty good experiences at my local gun stores. There, there's three of them that I go to, uh, you know, to purchase my firearms. There's one that that is strictly rifles, mainly ARs, and that's rifle gear. Um, and then I go to another place that's called Ammo Brothers, and uh, the one that I visit mostly is a, a chain that's in California only. I believe they're only in California. They're called Turner's Outdoorsman. And I have had pretty much uh, positive experiences at, at all of these places. Uh, I gotta say, the only thing I probably have had would be a bad experience is the wait. A couple of the places I go to, you gotta wait a long time to talk to somebody. You know, they have one of those number systems where you pull a ticket and then they call your number, and then they help you. But other than that, I've never had a really bad experience. I have had somebody talk me out of buying. Um, a certain firearm one time and uh, I'm actually glad that they did because um, if, if they hadn't to talk me out of it I wouldn't have my M&P here. Uh, originally when I was looking for a, a 40 cal I was looking at the uh, Smith & Wesson Sigma and I went into the, uh, the gun store and, and this is a gun store I frequent a lot the Turner's outdoorsmen they know me by name you know they walk they so they try and help me out as much as they can or give me what they feel is good good advice so anyway I walked in this place and I was looking at the uh, the Smith and Wesson Sigma and the salesman that was helping me says uh, you know what Jeff you you don't want that gun and I'm like well, I, I like it, you know, I, I had it in my hand, I was feeling it, and I liked the way it feel, felt, and and he goes, uh, no, he goes, here, and he, he uh, you know, put the slide back, and he goes, pull the trigger, you know, dry fire it, so I did that, and I said, okay, he goes, you feel how stiff that trigger is? He goes, it's not going to get any better, <laughs> that's basically what he told me. Then he handed me the M&P, and did the same thing. I dried fired it and oh this had such such a better trigger on it than uh, the Sigma so you know I was I was glad that uh, he talked me out of the uh, the Sigma I mean I wouldn't call that a bad experience but you know I kinda went in there to get a certain item and they talked me out of it but uh, other than that I've had nothing but good experiences at my uh, three local uh, gun dealers. So, um, I guess I'm supposed to tag somebody. Um, let's see, someone that has a lot of experience with guns. Uh, you know what, I, I've tagged this guy before in, in other videos and, and uh, Sometimes I think he's a go-to guy, but I'm, I'm going to tag Armed Medic, see if he's uh, had any bad experiences in good gun stores. So, all right, there you go. Bob, thank you for uh, tagging me, and uh, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll talk to you later. Goodbye.